You know, when I travel, I love to see the natural beauty of a place, any place that I'm going. And apparently so do many other travelers. The top 20 natural wonders in the U.S. and Hawaii were ranked. And Hawaii Island's Kilauea Volcano made it to number two on the oh, wait, list. Number two? Uh-huh. Oh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Now, before ah. I reveal the number one spot, fun fact, do you know that there are over 160 active volcanoes in the U.S. Yeah. and Hawaii, but mm -hmm. Kilauea is one of the most active volcanoes on Earth. Yep, follow me. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think it about Mount St. Helens. Um, yeah, actually, well, that's in Washington area, mm -hmm. yeah? But most of them are along Alaska. I mean, oh. because it's they're all still making islands. They're also making islands up there. When was the last time you guys went to Kilauea? Oh, gosh, it's been a long time. I think mm, Mary Monarch. 1997. Oh, so that's when Puuo'o was like just a little bump. Wow. Yeah, like a bump. It might be a great idea for all of us as Kanaka to step out and visit our own natural wonders in Hawaii. There's Opaika'a Falls oh, on yeah. Kauai. That's yes, the backyard. Yep. Mm -hmm. There's Halona Blowhole right here on Oahu. And then there's Sunrise at Haleakala. By the way, number one on the list. Okay, what was it? The Grand Canyon. Oh, okay. The okay, Grand Canyon, yeah. Well, we got, you know, Waimea Canyon on Kauai. Yes, we got our we, own canyon. We, we call it the baby Grand Canyon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Baby Grand Canyon. Yeah. <laughs> Grand Canyon Lee. <-y. laughs> <laughs> now, you know, I have a lot of favorite Chinese actors. Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee, Alexander Fusheng, right now. That's my jam. That's our jam. He's, he's my boyfriend. Mm -hmm. Michelle <laughs> Yeoh, Lucy Liu, and others. But this other favorite of mine has the most iconic voice of them all. Take a listen. The secret ingredient of my secret ingredient soup. Oh. Come here. The secret ingredient is nothing. <laughs> I love him. Okay, this is actor James Hong, who celebrated his 95th birthday yesterday Aww. by cementing his place in Hollywood history at the famed TCL Chinese Theater oh, in Hollywood. Yeah. An imprint of his hands and feet, along with his signature, were captured in cement as guest speakers like Lucy Liu and other big stars spoke on his behalf. Now, he has literally has hundreds of movies to his credit, um, and his career spans seven decades. In yeah. fact, he reprises his role as Mr. Ping in the upcoming film Kung Fu Panda 4, which hits theaters on March 8th. And he now joins a list of Hollywood legends who have also been immortalized at the Chinese theater. Clark Gable, Humphrey Bogart, John Wayne, Jack Nicholson. It's amazing. Legends. I love, I love him in... Um Big Trouble, Little China. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that's a classic yeah. right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. grew up with that James yep. Hong. That's mm -hmm. right. And, you know, it is said that the best job is the one that pays you to do what you love. So if you're a super fan of Taylor Swift, listen up. One of the top museums in London, the Victoria and Albert Museum, is looking for a Taylor Swift super fan to advise expert curators on her importance to the history of art and design, including those friendship bracelets, which she has turned into a phenom. So for perspective, museum curators make about fifty to eighty thousand dollars a year can you imagine being told by a teenager what to acquire for a museum <laughs> because that's what they can do then you know a teenager can go in and, and get the job and if you're not a taylor swift fan then if but if you like pokemon or lego or emojis or even drag or crocs you could have a job wow. at this museum wow. one of the top museums in london drag too yes brother <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna head to break now. Today is Skip the Straw Day. If you didn't know, so if you're heading to a drive-thru today, tell them you know you don't straw. Yeah, just skip the straw and just just save the honu. Uh. Yes, honu. Hon That's what I said. Save the honu. <laughs> It's also Emily Blunt's birthday star of A Quiet Place. Shh, quiet, you guys. If you're <laughs> celebrating, we've got your birthday song coming up in about 30 minutes. And congratulations to Hawaii's very own Maohi Nui for winning first place in the Otea and Mehura category in the Hawaii Paris competition. They're representing Hawaii in the United States in the amateur division and they have won one more day to go. So let's wish them good luck Yee. and hope they bring home the overall trophy. Ooh, go Maohi Nui! I taught them all those moves. I, I taught them that. <laughs> I, I taught them that, yeah? First place! See ya!